Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Lisa and today I'm going to be stuffing my cash envelopes for the week of April the 23rd. Uh, this is the second week in this paycheck, so I am going to pull the money out of my week two envelope. I go to the bank one time after I'm paid and I split the money into two envelopes, one for one, one for the first week and one for the second week. So this is the second week of this paycheck and so uh, this is the money that I'll be stuffing today. Let's go ahead and count it so you guys know how much I will be adding to my envelopes. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, and 96. So 296 dollars for this week. All right, let me go ahead and grab my budget here. I'm just gonna set this off to the side so that I have it handy should I need it. I think I pretty much have my budget kind of down to a science and I, for the most part, know um, what I will stuff. Let me see which order. I'm gonna put these in a specific order this time. Last time it was just kind of like willy-nilly. Let's see here. Let me get my cash categories first and then then we will do sinking funds. Um, oh, actually, before I stuff, let me just uh, mention, you won't see the YouTube envelope in here. I did order um, the items for the giveaway. What I ended up doing, and you guys gave me a lot of great suggestions, and I decided to go ahead and get cash envelopes for the giveaway. I ordered them from Our Budget Life. Uh, she has a YouTube channel. She's on Etsy. That's where I got these envelopes uh, from. And I ordered five sets. So it's been a long time since I've done a giveaway. And I think I've just recently uh, gotten into, I think I'm just now recently uh, at 8,000 subscribers, which I appreciate you guys so, so much. And I wanted to do, you know, a giveaway that I could offer to multiple people. So I ordered five sets of envelopes and there will be five winners. Um, I am going to have to check on the shipping for international. I'm not really sure if I'll open it up to international or not, but I, I will check into it. But I don't have the envelope because I spent the money. And if you guys have ever purchased anything from Our Budget Life or if you've ever checked her out on Etsy, you'll see that her envelopes are really reasonable. They are under $10 for each set of either five or six. So I am really excited for you guys to see the envelopes that I selected. I hope that you guys love them. But just so that you know, I forgot to mention in my last stuffing that the money, I didn't have that envelope uh, to show you guys because I, I did spend the money in that envelope and a giveaway is coming. I'm really excited. All right, well, with that being said, let's start with groceries. So as of the last stuffing, which I did off camera for this one, but uh, I had gone to Walmart, spent $98, had $2 left. I am adding $100 to this envelope today. So on this tracker, which I'm, now when I purchased these envelopes from Our Budget Life, they came with the tracker, so I'm hoping that the ones that I got for the giveaway will also come with trackers. Um, so on this tracker, I'm gonna write the date, which I'm gonna write the 23rd, which would be Friday. Deposit, adding 100, and that'll give me 102 in this envelope. So here is 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. And I think my daughter and I finally kind of have a, a handle on our groceries. The last time we went shopping, when we spent the 98, I went with her. And as she was going down the aisle, she was like, ooh, we, do we need olive oil? I think we need olive oil. And I'm like, eh, I don't, I don't know. It's not on the list. And she's like, oh, yeah, let's pick up some olive oil. And of course she got the big bottle and it's, you know, what, $5. It's just a great value brand, but I'm thinking I'm already like in my Walmart app, I, 
if you guys are new here, I use the Walmart app to try to build my grocery list so that I know um, about how much I have um, in my virtual cart, right? So I know what that total is or something close to it. And it helps me to stay on budget when I go shopping because I already have an idea of how much the items I have in my um, in my grocery list are going to cost me. So I'm like, well, crap. Now she's like putting this $5 bottle of olive oil in the cart. And I'm already, I think my virtual cart was like at $95. So I had only allocated a little bit for tax. So I had to go through the virtual cart and like take something out. So, um, for example, I wanted some, uh, vegan, sausage patties so like soy patties and so I removed those from the list and then we went down another aisle and she's like oh let's get some macaroni and cheese and you know in the grand scheme of things is three dollars a big deal probably not but when you're on a tight budget every little you know dollar and penny and nickel that you spend does matter so I have to take something else out of the cart and we did this the entire trip and then she was like didn't you want to get something for, you know, your, uh, your biscuits? Didn't you want some fake sausage? I'm like, yeah, but you, you grabbed olive oil. So now I can't get that. And I think, I think y'all, I think she's starting to get it. So we are sticking to the budget, $100 uh, for this week, 102 in total will give us just a teeny bit of wiggle room. But, uh, I think we finally, I think I finally gotten through to her. We'll see. <laughs> All right, next is Fur Babies. This is the envelope that I carry with me. This is for their food. I've got a puppy and a kitty. My puppy is six. Kitty is three years old. The money in this envelope is for their food. Wet food, dry food, kitty litter treats. Any of that kind of good stuff is, is what uh, I spend this money on. So as of the last stuffing, I spent 16 at Walmart had 20 left over I'm adding 20 today so that should give me a balance of 40. Um, I went to uh, what was it PetSmart back I think last week or the week before and I I got Chewy his uh, Merrick dog food y'all that is expensive how much was it it was $24 for a four pound bag I nearly croaked um, so um, he goes to the vet here in the next two weeks and I'm going to ask them about just switching his food back to something a little less expensive. So anyway, I've got 40 now in this envelope series, 20 and 40. And I don't know, I think it's my turn to buy the kitty litter. My daughter and I are kind of swapping, uh, turns, uh, or taking turns rather buying the kitty litter and the dry food and wet food for the cat think it might be my turn so I may be spending some of this money all right next is personal spending and as of the last stuffing I did a little bit of shopping so I had 35 left over um, I will be adding oh no I guess I didn't so on the 23rd I added is that right I can't even read my own writing maybe the 20th um, I added 20 and I had 35, and now I'm gonna add another 20, so that'll give me 55, which is exciting. My daughter wants to go see a movie, and we don't have uh, a movie picked out, but we definitely want to, definitely wanna go see a movie. It's been a while. All right, here is 20, so that is 20, 40, 45, 50, and 55. I think uh, this weekend we might go to Hot Springs, which is absolutely beautiful. I haven't been in years um, and might spend some of this money exploring and, and maybe going to some of the little shops that they have there. All right, next is gas and oil changes. Now I had added 20. I still have 20 left over, haven't spent anything, so I am going to be adding another 20 today. Oh, I see. I stuffed on the 20th, so I'm doing it again on the 23rd. Um, so deposit. I was really behind doing my stuffing this last time. So that'll give me 40. After I got paid 
on Friday, we went straight to Walmart and did our grocery shopping as soon as I got off work and there just wasn't time to do a video. But here is my gas envelope. So $40 is the balance. I need to put a little bit of gas into this loaner car that the dealership gave me. Uh, let's see, household. So this is for cleaning supplies, paper towels, paper plates, toilet paper, all that kind of good stuff. So let's see here, four, 23, deposit, I'm gonna add 20 and that'll give me 25. So 25 for household. Definitely need toilet paper this week. So that is household supplies. Now we are moving into my sinking funds. The first one is for fur babies. This is for their vet visits, uh, shots, that kind of good stuff. I had $155 in here. I'm gonna be adding 20 today. So that should give me 175. And um, Chewy has a vet appointment, but it's not for shots. So I'm gonna cash flow his uh, follow-up from his surgery. They may not charge me. They didn't charge me for the last one. All right, so 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 70, and 75. So that is for fur babies. All right, next is for gifts. This is for Mother's Day, Father's Day, and birthdays. As of the last stuffing, I had 140. I'm adding 20 today, so that will give me 160. And you don't have any birthdays coming up the next two weeks, so I won't be spending any money in this envelope. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60. But we do have Mother's Day coming up, which... This is, I think, the first Mother's Day in a while that I will get to spend with my mom in person. I'm super excited about it. All right, next is Christmas. And as of the last stuffing, Christmas had $460. I am adding 20 today, so that'll give me 480 So just writing again, deposit, date, all that good stuff. Here's 20 so here is 100, 200, 300, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80. Next time I go to the ATM, well, I guess it'll be next week, I will pull out some more, uh, at least one more $100 bill so I can, I can swap it out, 400. So that is for Christmas. Now, the last envelope is the new phone. And what did I do here? Okay. Um, for, I think I figured this out last, was it last stuffing? I think I was $10 short. So there's the $10 I was short. And is that right? 20, 45. Yeah. So what is left here is for the phone. And so I ended up using my debit card for, um, for the the order the Etsy order is that right yeah I ended up using my debit card for the Etsy order so I still had cash and then like a few random dollars I think from probably rounding up or rounding down I I don't know I think I thought I took out the right amount of money apparently I didn't so whatever is here I'm just going to put in my new phone um category so as a debt-free gift to myself, I am saving up for a new cell phone. I currently film on an iPhone 6S, and I would really like to get the iPhone 12 Pro. I think that I think I'm saying that right. Um, so I am going to save a little bit of money every single week and uh, add it to this envelope. So let me count this. So you guys know how much I'll stop. There's 20. 30, 40, 50, 55, 56 dollars for the new phone, which is pretty exciting. So that gives me 100 and what 66. Okay. 
Let me just count that just to be sure. So I guess the the amount that I'll actually put in savings will be a little bit less since I uh, since I use my debit card, but that's okay. Uh, let's see, new phone. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 30, 40, 50, 65, 66. And that is the last category. So I, you know, I am really excited about this giveaway. I know I've been talking about it and counting that $50 in that envelope for quite some time. So I am can't wait to get it in. I did get a notification that my order has shipped. And I can't wait to get them in hand uh, so that I can share with you everything that I picked out. Um, so stay tuned for a giveaway because it is, it is finally coming. Anyway, that is everything, guys. That is my cash envelope and sinking fund stuffing. Again, this is for the week of April the 23rd. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you have a great day or night wherever you're at. Bye.